Our planet is always on the move. Spinning like a top, Earth races around the sun at incredible speeds. Imagine yourself on a merry-go-round. That's Earth rotating on its axis. Now picture that merry-go-round itself zipping around a track. That's Earth orbiting the sun. It's a cosmic dance we experience every day without even realizing it. We don't feel Earth spinning because we're moving right along with it. Think about being on an airplane. When it's cruising smoothly, you don't feel like you're hurtling through the air at hundreds of miles per hour. Similarly, we're bound to Earth by gravity, moving in perfect sync with its spin. It's like being on a giant spinning spaceship. We don't feel the movement because we're moving together with everything else around us, the air, the oceans, even the buildings. Just like on that airplane, as long as the motion is smooth and constant, we don't perceive it. Inertia is a fancy word for an object's tendency to keep doing what it's already doing. A ball at rest wants to stay at rest, and a ball in motion wants to stay in motion in a straight line at a constant speed, unless acted upon by an external force. This resistance to change in motion is what we call inertia. Imagine rolling a bowling ball down a lane. It keeps moving in a straight line because of inertia. Now think about what happens when the ball hits the pins. The pins fly off in different directions because the ball's inertia overcame their own inertia of being at rest. In the same way, Earth's rotation imparts inertia to everything on it, including us. We're constantly moving with the planet, and our inertia keeps us moving right along with it. It's like riding a roller coaster. You feel the force of the turns and drops because your body wants to keep moving in a straight line. Gravity is the force that pulls everything towards the center of the Earth. It's what keeps us grounded and prevents us from floating off into space. Gravity acts like an invisible tether, constantly pulling us towards the planet's core. Think about throwing a ball straight up in the air. It goes up, slows down, stops for a brief moment and then falls back down. That's gravity at work, pulling the ball back towards Earth. Gravity affects everything on Earth, from the smallest insect to the largest mountain. Gravity is also what gives us our sense of weight. It's the force our bodies exert on the ground due to Earth's gravitational pull. Without gravity, we would be weightless, like astronauts floating in space. We don't feel Earth spinning because we're moving together with it, at the same speed and in the same direction. It's all about relative motion. Our perception of movement depends on our frame of reference. Think about sitting in a car at a red light. If a car next to you starts moving forward, it might feel like you're moving backward. That's because your brain uses the other car as a reference point. In reality, you're stationary, and the other car is moving forward. Similarly, because we're moving with Earth, we don't perceive its rotation as a separate motion. Our reference point is the Earth itself, so we feel stationary even though we're moving at incredible speeds. Our senses are designed to detect changes in motion, not constant motion. When you're on a moving train, you only feel the acceleration or deceleration, not the constant speed. Similarly, Earth's rotation is smooth and constant, so we don't feel it. Think about being on a carousel. You can feel the wind in your hair and see the scenery going by, but you don't feel the constant spinning motion. Your senses adapt to the constant movement, and your brain filters it out. It's the same with Earth's rotation. Our senses have adapted to the constant spinning so we don't feel it. It's a testament to the power of our brains to filter out unnecessary information and focus on what's important for our survival. Earth's spin is a marvel of the universe, a delicate balance of forces that has allowed life to flourish on our planet. We may not feel it, but we are constantly moving, whirling through space at incredible speeds, it's a reminder that our everyday experience is just a small part of a much larger cosmic dance. The next time you look up at the night sky, remember that you're standing on a spinning planet, orbiting a star in a vast and ever-expanding universe. It's a humbling thought, but also an inspiring one. We are part of something much greater than ourselves, a cosmic ballet that has been going on for billions of years.